Good day, viewers. We need to thank the Lord today for adding another year to the life of our Father in the Lord. Pastor E.A. E. Adeboe, the General Overseer of the Redeemed Christian Church of God. We pray that the Lord will continue to uphold him in the mighty name of Jesus. My name is Adi Ajayi. I am the pastor of RCCJ Thanksgiving House, a parish of the Redeemed Christian Church of God based in Gemsford in Essex, United Kingdom. It is my honor to present to you the Open Heavens Reflections today. Based on the Open Heavens Daily Guide written by Pastor E. Adebay, the General Overseer of the Redeemed Christian Church of God. And the topic today, a witness or betrayer. A witness or betrayer. And we're taking our main Bible passage from John chapter 1, verse 20 to 34. He confessed and did not deny, but confessed, I am not the Christ. And he asked him, What then? Are you Elijah? He said, I am not. Are you the prophet? And he answered, No. Then he said to him, Who are you? That we may give an answer to those who sent us. What do you say about yourself? He said, I am the voice of one crying in the wilderness. Make straight the way of the Lord. As the prophet Isaiah said, now those who were sent were from the Pharisees. And they asked him, saying, Why then do you baptize you and not the Christ, nor Elijah, nor the prophet? John answered them, saying, I baptize with water, but there stands one among you whom you do not know. It is he who coming after me is preferred before me, whose sandal strap I am not worthy to lose. These things were done in Batbar, beyond the Jordan, where John was baptizing. The next day, John saw Jesus coming toward him and said, Behold, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sin of the world. This is he of whom I said, After me comes a man who is preferred before me, for he was before me. I did not know him, but that he should be revealed to Israel. Therefore, I came baptizing with water. And John bore witness, saying, I saw the Spirit descending from heaven like a dove, and he remained upon him. I did not know him, but he who sent me to baptize with water said to me, Upon whom you see the Spirit descending and remaining on him, this is he who baptizes with the Holy Spirit. And I've seen them testify that this is the Son of God. A memory verse, taken from the book of Matthew, chapter 26, verse 48. Now his Britain had given them a sign, saying, Whomever I kiss, he is the one sees him. Our reflections. During the time of Jesus, there were two sets of people that were always around him. The first are the betrayers. The mission, just like that of their father, the devil, is to destroy his ministry and get him into trouble. These they did through incriminating questions. Judas Iscariot ended up being their chief performing officer and ended his life in shame. The others, who were really very few were the witnesses. The woman of Samaria was the best performer in this camp. They wanted to let everybody know about what Jesus was doing and promoting what he was doing. Can you take some time to ask yourself today, which of the camps do you belong? If you are on the wrong side, change position today and the Lord will smile on you. Our action point. Are you a betrayer? or a witness of the gospel. Uh, we pray for our daddy in the Lord, the General Vasir, this special day, that God will continue to strengthen him. And as our father in the Lord takes the gospel to all the nations all over the world, we ask for increased anointing upon him 
We ask for open doors. We ask that the Lord Almighty will preserve his, his life. We pray that the glory of God will continually be revealed and increased over his life and his ministry. God bless you, Daddy Geo. Happy birthday to you. And may the Lord Almighty continue to pour his anointing upon you. We love you, dear. Have a good day. God bless.